Ever wondered what actually happens during a shoulder replacement? Let's break down the entire procedure in six quick steps. First, the patient is put under anesthesia and a small incision is made over the shoulder to access the damaged joint. The arthritic humeral head, the upper arm bone, is removed carefully. The humerus is then hollowed out and filled with cement. A metal ball with a stem is gently pressed to fit in the humerus. Next, the glenoid, that's the shoulder socket, is cleaned, getting rid of worn cartilage and unhealthy bone. It is reshaped and then fitted with a strong plastic liner. The new ball attached to the humerus is placed into the newly lined socket. The joint is tested for smooth movement, then the incision is closed. Most patients go home the same day or after one night, depending on the case. Rehab is key. Many people see big gains by three to six months, with continued improvement after that. Comment your questions and hit follow for more medical breakdowns.